Andy, how you doing, brother? Yeah, good, good to see you, man. Stephen Cureno, KO Artist Sports, right here with Andy Ruiz. Uh, first man, tell me, obviously you and uh, Eddie and Canelo are obviously still on good terms, everything's all good. Uh, what did you learn most, uh, do you feel, out of that camp? Um, a lot, you know, the discipline, the me having to work hard, especially of, of me having my own gym, you know, my own facility where I could say if I can't sleep at night, boom, what do I want to do? Drive to my own facility, my own gym, boom, start hitting the bags or boom, I'm mad or something, something take me off. What do I want to do? Go straight to hit the punching bag, stuff like that. And I would, I didn't have that before, you know, even when I was over here in L.A. neither. But now I have the, the tools to go in there and um, do what I want to do, especially by having my, the trainer, too, behind me. Um, I call him up, hey, are you ready? Let's train. And, you know, he's, he's there 100 percent. So it was time to make that step of getting my own gym, kind of, kind of be, being your own man, so to speak, yeah. of the gym, right? Exactly, because I feel once you do that, I feel you become more disciplined. You become, it's a more of a, of a habit, you know, of me training and training and, you know, getting ready, especially having my, my, my different fighters that I have, uh, trainers, um, it's more motivating and they push me more to the limit. Luis Ortiz is a southpaw man. We were talking earlier. His first yeah. first southpaw is that. I mean, this is a, 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 a kind of a crazy time to be taking that that much of a risk. Man, credit credit to you for for taking on such a such a big fight in in the the part of your career you're at. Yeah, that's exactly what I wanted to do. I didn't want to cherry pick um, any other fighter because I thought Luis Ortiz is a is a good example. You know, he's a he's one of the top guys out there. Uh, but I don't know for some reason in my heart. Uh, I feel like I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna pull this out, man. I know he's gonna be hard. I know he might move around the lefty, but I think my, my ability is gonna, I'm gonna be able to win. Obviously, fans are, are gonna look at this fight, look at you, and, and obviously your fans are gonna, you know, hope for a knockout because that kind of is the measuring stick with Lee, Luis Ortiz, right? His only losses are to, to Deontay Wilder, and I mean, it seems like with a, with a win, period, it looks like Wilder might, might be next. Hopefully, man. But first, we just gotta we gotta win Luis Ortiz. Um, like I said, it's not it's not gonna be easy. It's gonna be difficult. But we wanted this. Especially, I wanted this. The people wanted this. So exactly why we picked this fight and gave him the opportunity as well. Another fight I know that you you'd love to have the trilogy with Anthony Joshua. He has a big fight against uh, Usyk. How do you see that playing out? Especially now that Joshua has uh, you know Robert Garcia in his corner. What what is Robert Garcia gonna gonna do to tweak his game? You think? I think that was a good move as well. You know, I think sometimes we gotta we gotta um, learn from different trainers. You know, because every trainer that we got, we we learn. You know, it's like a little muscle memory that we learn and gets to our head, but. Um, I think he needed that, that Mexican trainer to, to, to make him be aggressive, you know. I think he needed that aggressiveness against Usyk. He's a bigger guy, a stronger guy, but, you know, Usyk is a man of God and he's a Christian and, you know, God willing, he's going to take the victory as well. But if he doesn't and I win this, I win this fight and then I don't fight um, Dante Wilder, I'd love to do the, the trilogy. And an aggressive Joshua against uh, Andrew Ruiz would be great, brother. I'd love That'd to see great, it. great because there's a lot of fireworks right there. Yes, sir. Hey, brother, it's been great seeing your, your progression throughout these yeah. years, man. Appreciate yeah. you, brother. Thank you.